Hello again, I am Blunty. Now, a lot of you out there are already aware that there are massive, massive floods happening in Australia at the moment, in Queensland, as a matter of fact, which is the state I used to live in, uh, in and around Brisbane, and there's huge flooding happening, the worst floods in almost 40 years, as a matter of fact. And I'm, if, if you're not from Australia, you're not that familiar with the, the geography of Australia, I want to put this in perspective for you. This is a map of the United States of America. This is a map of the same scale of Australia, overlaid on it. A lot of people are surprised when you point that out, that Australia, landmass-wise, pretty much close to America. And these areas are, are, are the ones that are affected by floods at the moment. Huge, massive, massive areas of Queensland just underwater at the moment. And to those of you who've been writing in to me and, and, and asking if I'm okay, yes, I'm okay. I don't actually uh, live in Brisbane anymore. I moved to Sydney uh, a little over a year ago. And while the weather in Sydney is rather unpleasant at the moment, it's not actually ruining people's lives. So I guess I'm okay. And I, I know I, I'm tr I seem like I'm making light of this and making a joke. And it's only because if I start to think too seriously about what the people in those flood affected areas are actually going through at the moment, I'm afraid that I will completely break down. Because while I've never been through a natural disaster personally, um, I, ha I do know what it is like from personal experience uh, to have most of your life and, and just about everything you own and, and just everything you know and love and can rely on and just destroyed and taken away from you and all that sort of stuff. And it's, uh, it's incredibly traumatic. So yes, I'm okay. Thank you to everyone who was asking. Um, and thank goodness my, my friends and loved ones uh, who are in Brisbane are still all okay and uh, are doing their best to, to help out when and how they can as well. And I'm, I'm very proud of that. I mean, just the, the sheer scale of this is, is almost incomprehensible. I, I struggle to wrap my head around it and just how many people are affected. And it's not just people who are directly affected who, who have got, you know, water in their houses or their cars have been flung down the streets by flash floodwaters and things like that. I mean, there are people who, who simply can't get to their jobs or can't get to their family because the, the way there has been completely cut off. And, you know, the, all the infrastructure is falling apart and it's, it's overwhelming even for me sitting here. So, I wanted to make this video to sort of try and give my perspective of what's going on there and to show you some links so you can get information up on the screen right now are a couple of websites the uh, brisbane.qld.gov.au uh, for information and if you'd like to make a donation and I, I of course seriously encourage each and every one of you to donate at least something uh, www.qld.gov.au slash floods slash donate dot html uh, the links are on the screen but they're also in the text which accompanies this video so you can just click on them and go directly there and if you're on Twitter and you want to see some some real-time news and information and hopes and prayers and all that sort of stuff coming through on the Twitter feed the hashtag is uh, is hash QLD floods uh, okay look I, I know this video is a bit disjointed and a bit broken and, and fractured and, and weird and this isn't my strongest suit presenting this kind of information, as you can imagine. And, you know, I've got friends and loved ones up there who I'm, I'm uh, just desperately worried about uh, and, and proud of, too, because I've got friends who are opening up their homes to, to people who have lost theirs or, or can't get back to theirs or whatever. And it's, it's a huge disaster up there. And if you have the means to help out, I really hope that you do. So please um, help out because it's... Uh, it's wrecked up there right now. And, you know, there are places I used to go for walks, which are several feet underwater right now. And that's weird to think about. And the thing is, as bad as it is already up there, the Bureau of Meteorology are already predicting that it's going to continue to get worse. So everybody who's already been affected needs your help. There are people who haven't been affected yet. They're going to need your help. So I want you to help. 